Well, we did see some relief in emerging markets today. Finally, stocks rebounding from the lowest levels of 2009. Some stabilization of currencies. Still, it's going to be an uphill battle to any recovery. Look at Russia as a proxy for the kind of stress that these countries are under. The chart here is the dollar against the Russian ruble. This is a wild chart. You can see it go up. The ruble has absolutely tanked. It's lost 50% of its value in one year. It's one of the hardest hit currencies. It's also an example of the kind of currency that's really getting hit the hardest, really in the crosshairs, and that is a commodity exporter getting squeezed by falling oil prices and an emerging market whose fortune is tied to China. Brazil is also another example of that. And it's also representative of the policy dilemma that these central banks are facing. They're short on tools to stop their free falling currencies. How do you normally stop a currency from plummeting? You raise interest rates, but that could hurt the already weak economies, or you let the currencies fall even further, and that risks skyrocketing inflation or consumer prices going out of control. It's a policy dilemma, and it's scaring investors that there's not much that emerging market policymakers can actually do about it. But for many investors, guys, this all comes back to how it's going to impact the U.S. economy, of course. Here's a stat out of SockGen, and it could provide some comfort here. So the U.S., exports 13% of GDP. We're only exposed to the outside world in terms of the global economy. 13% of our economy is exports. Only a third of that is to emerging markets, according to SockGen. Of course, the concern, though, is that markets aren't trading off of the economic fundamentals, especially in this country. It's all about the fear factor and in emerging markets. That's still pretty elevated. Hey YouTube fans, I'm Landon Dowdy from CNBC. Thanks so much for checking out our channel. Here you'll find videos packed with all the info that you need to be smarter about your finances. Be sure and subscribe by clicking right here and click on all the videos around me to see CNBC's original series, Young Money, Tech Bet, Kramer's Mad Money, and all the latest from CNBC.